in this video just playing around with the 555 timer in this case this is my inverter circuit that I made there's a video for this it's a 12 volt inverter to 120 volts and I was just playing around with the waveform on the 555 the waveform is typically the pattern you see right here square wave you have DC pulses coming out of pin 3, you have the power going on with a positive pulse, and then the pulse disappears and it just goes to the flat line, 0 volts, positive pulse comes up again, and then drops back down to 0. As you can see, everything is above the 0 line, nothing is negative, it's not like an AC waveform, everything is above the 0 line right here. Now I wanted to modify this square wave and try and smooth it out more or less, make it look more like a sine wave. And that's exactly what I did with this little circuit over here. All you have to do is take a 470 ohm resistor coming from pin 3, which would be on this side. And the other side, the resistor goes into the positive side of a 6.8 microfarad electrolytic capacitor. And then you take the negative of the electrolytic and that goes to your ground and you're going to grab your signal from the junction point between the resistor and the positive on the electrolytic capacitor now the result of this is a very nice waveform more like a sine wave one side of the sine wave has a little bit of a sawtooth pattern but it's still a very nice form I'll show you in a second and what I'm going to do is I'm going to take, this is the wire going to my oscilloscope. I'm going to connect it to the junction point of these two. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you now on a scope. Right now. Okay, so this is the waveform we have coming out of pin 3 right now. All above the zero line. A square wave. Now I'm going to shape the wave with the resistor and capacitor to give it more of a sine wave look. And here we go. As you can see, it looks a lot more like a sine wave. Got a little bit of the sawtooth on the right side of the waveform. That's where the positive charge disappears and the voltage drops off. Now, if you'd like to have a, a waveform that's more AC, which means you're going to have half of it below the zero line, which will be a negative waveform, and you'll have half of it above, which will be positive. You can adjust that output from pin 3 by making this change. We're going to take that 470 ohm resistor on this side. Now this side you're going to ignore now, because this was just to show you how to make the square wave become more like a sine wave with the sawtooth pattern but this side is going to show you how to make the pattern more AC half the waveform will be negative and the other half will be positive using this so this is my um, pin 3 signal right here so we're going to put that onto the 470 resistor you're going to take the other side of the resistor and that goes into the positive of the electrolytic and then the negative of this electrolytic goes into the positive of this electrolytic and the negative will go to ground. These are both 10 microfarad. You can play around with the values to adjust the waveform and you can play around with that one which is the 470 but I played around with it and this seems to give you the best waveform. Okay so the wire that would be outgoing from the new pin 3 wire so your pin 3 would go into this resistor the other, si other side of the resistor here goes to the positive of the electrolytic, 10 microfarad. The negative side of this electrolytic is where your pin 3 new output would be from pin 3 with the modified waveform. But also from that spot you have the positive of this 10 microfarad. And then the negative of the electrolytic goes to the ground. And as you can see, the waveform is now half positive, half negative. There's a zero line marker right there, half of it's below, half of it's 
that's above. Let's adjust this over. You can see it better there. You can see it a lot better right there. Still have a little bit of the sawtooth pattern. Now you have more of an AC formation. You have half negative and half positive. See it's right down the middle. 